I need people to understand that if I text you H E H E, it's not <laughs> it's <laughs> it is not <laughs> it's <laughs> Hey son, can you uh take out the trash? Oh yeah, mama, of course. Let me just uh finish up this essay real quick. Huh, I asked you to do one thing, but it's alright, it's cool. But when I'm dead, buried, deceased, gone, you gonna miss me. I'm coming. I'm coming. One day at school, my teacher told me that everybody has secrets, so I went home and I told my mom, I know your secret, so she gave me $20 and told me, don't tell your father. So I decided to push my luck, and I went up to my dad, and I was like, Dad, I know your secret. So he gave me $50 and said, don't tell your mother. I get excited, and I go to the store with the money I just got, and I see the mailman outside, so I go up to him, and I tell him, I know your secret. The mailman says, oh, your mom told you? Come here, son. Ah, 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 ah. What are you screaming about? Ah. We practice this. You look like Shrek. Perfect. She told me to fuck off. Bro, women are crazy. Like, they overreact over the smallest things, you know? What are you doing? Oh, I'm just calling my girlfriend because she hasn't texted me back for 10 minutes. Samantha! Who are you fucking? You're fucking my dad, aren't you, Samantha? Hello? Uh, she hung up. Classic Samantha. <laughs> What? Uh, didn't that seem like a bit much? Oh, okay, I'm a simp, oh. Hey man, I hear your wife's pregnant. What? Yeah, congratulations, dude, that's awesome. <laughs> Whoa, no, 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 she, she's not. Oh, um, are you sure? No, I'm Chris. What did you just say? I don't know. I wasn't listening. Hey, dude, just stay calm. Where's my phone, Chris? I need to call her. Where's my fucking phone? Stay with me. Stay with me. Tell my son. Yes? I'm disappointed. Is that it? You sure you want that to be your last message? Uh, yeah. Okay, it's just I have to deliver that, and that's not real. Promise me. Okay, yeah, sure. He says he's disappointed. Wow, okay. Hey, Mom, let me introduce you to my girlfriend. Hi, it's a pleasure to finally meet you. <sighs> I, you couldn't find anything better? Hey, Mom, leave her alone, alright? I love her. Shut the fuck up! I was talking to her. Have fun at martial arts class? Yeah, I'm pretty much an elite fighting machine. Ow! Not fair! I wasn't ready! My bad. Just let me know when you're ready. Okay, now try to- Ow! I thought you were ready. You're not doing it right. You're supposed to punch me right here. Now that I've got your arm completely restrained, I can use your own body weight against you. Hi, uh, can I get one ticket for the movie? Yeah, of course. Which one? The movie. Oh, okay. Um, are you dumb on purpose? No. Then which movie do you want to see? The movie! Right there! I asked you, which one did you want to see? This one or this one? The movie too. Are you dumb on purpose? Oh. Okay. Um, well, you know what? Fuck you. Excuse me? Fuck you. The prequel to the movie. Fuck you, I excuse me. The sequel to the prequel to the movie. How can I help you today, Mrs. Mister. Mrs. Mister. What can I do you for? Um, you called me in. Yes! Yes! Yes, I did. Yes, I did. <laughs> I knew that. Let's have a look in here. What's going on with you? Oh, this is not good at all. What? Oh, how bad is it? You know what? I'm just gonna have to be honest with you. Not great. Oh no. I know she's my daughter and she, she is only four, but like, how is this supposed to be a cat? <sighs> Idiot. We have your actual test results here as well, don't worry. Okay, hang on, these are my results. Um, oh, and apparently I have scurvy. <laughs> Who knew? Oh, please, can you just give it to me straight? Whoa, we, we don't address people by their sexual orientation here. Doctor, am I sick or not? Yeah, dude, you're sick. Oh. No, no, you're not sick, but you are suffering from a gunshot wound in your left arm. Oh! I mean oh. shoulder. Oh, what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> well, scurvy, apparently. Oh. <laughs> Brilliant. Next! I just miss him so much, man. It's okay, man. He's in a better place now. Hey, guys, what's going on? His dog was killed in a hit and run yesterday. <laughs> I guess you could say his dog is... Deceased. Yes, he's dead. Where was the joke there? I guess you could say I was... 
right. Is he okay? Don't worry, he does his thing with everyone. And the thing is, is what he's saying isn't even punny. It's just always true. What year is it? <laughs> Guess you could say it's 2020. What's the passcode to your phone? Guess you could say it's uh, 8351. Well, damn, I wish my girlfriend was honest about that one. True. Guess you could say she's cheating on you. What? Hey, don't worry, man. That, that one can't be. With who? Guess you could say it's uh, Matthew. Is that true? Um, it is! What else are you hiding from me? Guess you could say he uh, killed your dog. Ooh, ooh, what? Guess you could Come say back. I ruined this for- Who took the cookie from the cookie jar? Eric! Who took the cookie from the cookie jar? Who, me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. Then who? John! Took the cookie from the cookie jar. Who, me? Yes, you. They found out. All right, everybody on the floor! Look out, he's got a gun! Oh my god! And remember, kids, if anyone harasses you, you just say, stop it, I don't like it. And that's the end of that. Stop it, I don't like it. All right, then stop it, I don't like it. I'll see you in class tomorrow, guys. Give me all your fucking money. Give me all your fucking money now. Stop it, I don't like it. Uh, you're lucky you know that one. Not, not everyone knows that one, you know? You're lucky. Oh, Jesus, thank fuck. Wait, you're kidding. I really like Eminem. I prefer Skittles. No, like the rapper. Why would you eat the rapper? Hey, boss, uh, I was just wondering, am I getting that promotion we've been talking about? Oh, Steve, I, of course. You're my best employee. Steve's definitely not getting that promotion. What? What? You, you just looked at the wall and said I wasn't getting the promotion. No, I didn't. I totally just did that. Oh, uh, you did it again. Did what again? Okay, now you're just playing dumb and it's really pissing me off. No, I'm not. Yes, I did. And if Steve's pissed off about this, he wouldn't want me to tell him about me eating his lunch. What? You're the one who ate my lunch? How many other things have you not told me? Nothing. I swear, that's it. That's definitely not it. I was also the one who wrote That's What Abortion Is For in his truck after his son came out as a furry. You wrote That's What Abortion Is For in my truck? Seriously? Go ahead. Tell me something else. I guess I shouldn't tell him about how I slept with his wife, either. There is a snake in your bathtub! Oh, yeah, that's my pet snake, Ron. I have a pet s Why do you name him Ron? I named him after Ron Weasley from Harry Potter. Why didn't you just name him after the snake that's in the movie? I thought Ron was a cooler name. Okay, anyway, you're lucky he's not venomous because he could have killed me! Oh, no, he is venomous. You have a venomous snake in your bed. Why is he not in a cage? He hasn't bitten anyone yet. Oh. Well, how long have you had him for? I bought him, like, two and a half hours ago? Oh, I'm gonna beat your ass! Dude, where were you yesterday? I was at my grandma's funeral, you know this. Damn, re really? Oh man, that sucks, dude, you know, but about time, because, you know, that bitch was so old when someone told her to act her age, she just died. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't heard that oh, one before. So it's just a joke, bro, no hard feelings. You know what? No, it it's not just a joke, man, it goes deeper than that. Yeah, almost as deep as your mom. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one, that was a good one. God, you are a pathetic clown who gets attention from everyone for being loud and obnoxious because your parents don't give you enough attention at home. You're right. My parents don't give me enough attention. I guess it's not their fault, though, you know. They have been dead for the past 12 years. That's horrible, but it, it, it doesn't change the way I feel about you, okay? I remember when I used to feel. I think it was the third time my grandpa beat my paraplegic little sister. That's when I stopped feeling. Okay, I get it. There was this one time I saved my little brother from a rogue grenade. God, a what have I done? Hey, son. Yeah, Dad? Uh, me and your mom need to talk with you, so be in the living room. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll be there. It's just, uh, um, could I finish this game first? I'm so close. Sure, but uh, make it quick, okay? You got it. My time has come. They figured out I'm not the innocent Christian boy they thought I was. What a shame. Years of secrets all comes down to this. It was a good run, but whatever they know about me now is irrelevant. I must use these final moments to my advantage. With only two years till my 18th birthday, victory is practically in the palm of my hands. I've tried my best to be the good guy, but I did what I had to do. I was cautious, but unfortunately nobody's perfect. Why must life be so cruel? Why must I have to face this alone? Whatever happens next is for fate to decide. I have nothing to hide. I have nothing to protect. I am an open book. But at what cost? That we will see. You needed me? Grandma died. <laughs> yes! What? 
My dad just texted me that I uh, need to come home and have a meeting with him and mom because apparently she was diagnosed with cancer this morning. Wait a second. Cancer? Cancer? Can sure try to fit these nuts in your mouth? Okay, okay, dad. It's definitely going to be a D's nuts joke. <laughs> So why do you want to marry my daughter? Well, to be honest, sir, she's a fat ass. That's the same reason I married her mother. <laughs> you have my permission. So why do you want to marry my daughter? Well, to be honest, sir, she's a fat ass. That's the same reason I married her mother. <laughs> you have my permission. All right, we need you to release the hostages without harming them. Well, our clients want you to give them the money and let them escape. I'll handle this. Hey, what if we doubled what they're paying you? Will you stop? I'll take care of this guy. What if we tripled your salary? Would you stop? Yeah, nice try. You said triple? Hey, wake up. You're free to go. What? Why? Somebody bailed you out. What? But I don't... I don't even know anyone. Who the fuck are you? Emmett? Okay, Emmett, did you bail me out of jail? Yeah. Well, why? I wanted to show you my hat. You bailed me out of jail because you wanted to show me your hat. Yeah, I just bought it. Wasn't my bail like $20,000? 25 So do you like no, it? No, not really. No. Fuck. Derek, how was your test today? Not too bad. I got an F. That's that's bad. Okay, then bad. Pretty bad. So you failed your test? Yep, and then Miss Henson gonna say she wanna have a one-on-one -on -one with me. Oh, okay, so she wants Fight to... me. What? She wants to fight me. No, she wants to have a... She wants to sit down and teach you. She wants to go over the lesson one-on-one. -on -one. Oh. I pushed her old ass down the stairs. Holy shit. She never got up. She never got up. Peanut butter? Thanks. Wait, aren't you allergic to peanuts? No. <laughs> you're allergic to peanuts. Any last words? I'm pretty sure you're allergic to peanuts. Oh, you know what it is? We're both allergic to peanuts. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I lost my first tooth! Oh wow, good job, Timmy! You know, if you put the tooth under a pillow at night, a tooth fairy can come by and give you a dollar. Really? Yeah, so don't forget to put it under there, okay? Hey! Oh my god! Are you Timmy? Yes. You, uh, you lose teeth, yeah? Y y yes Okay, give it me. Um, my mom said you're supposed to give me a dollar. I yeah, mother asshole, stupid roll, take my money. Uh, I, uh, give you 25 cent, okay? 75? 40! 60? 50 cent, okay? Alright, fine. Okay, give me your teeth. <sighs> You mean tooth, right? That's a singular for teeth. Did I stutter? Oh! Okay, so get this. You make 10 meals, you're not a cook. You make 20 paintings, you're not an artist. But you kill one person! Man, you look kinda upset. Is there anything you wanna talk about? Why the fuck is there so many letters in Wednesday? Shit, you right there. There's a lot of letters in there. Oh, that shit say Wednesday's day! It was like, what is this wasting it? Yo, want to ding dong ditch a completely random house? Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Which one should we do? Uh, let's do that one. Well, bud, doesn't look like anyone's going to show up to your birthday party this year. Again. I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. Maybe, maybe next year. Yeah. Probably not. But hey, at least we got all this birthday cake to ourselves now, right? Yeah, that's true, I guess. And you did get chocolate cake again this year. I'm still allergic to chocolate, but... Yeah. Okay, so I just got my DNA test results back, and, uh, I'm surprised. <laughs> I surprised? I'm dad. <laughs> That's the funny thing. You're not.
Is there something you want to tell me? Okay, they said they love you and they miss you a lot. Aw, I miss them too. Tell them I'll have to sell their shit though. Uh-uh, uh-uh, tell that bitch not to touch, touch my shit at all. Okay, they said do, do not disturb their belonging. That's not how they talk. What they really said. Yeah, say exactly what the fuck I said. I need this bitch to know. They said not to touch their shit. See here, I knew the fuck he would say some shit like that. Because I'm not keeping that. That's dead people shit. I bet. I'm finna haunt your ass since you need a motherfucker to be around. He's, he's finna haunt you. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm gonna check and see if the house is safe before I go to bed. Hey, are there any stabbers down there? No, it's okay. Okay, good. If your leg get cut off, would it hurt? Duh. How though? Cause your leg got cut off, fool. Where you gonna feel the pain? In your leg. Exactly, bro. How you gonna feel the pain in your leg if your, your leg, leg is, is gone? gone? This is my boyfriend Derek. This is Derek's boyfriend Ben. Wait, sorry, what's the situation? Derek is gay, but he's straight for me, but he's gay for Ben, and Ben's really gay for Derek. And I hate Ben. It's not that complicated. We need to break up. We need to break up. We need to break up. We need, we need to break up. We should break up. I think that we sh I think that we should break up. I think that we should break up. Listen, I think that we need All to- All right, I get it. Thanks for watching the kids, Ma. Da, I appreciate it. My pleasure. Oh, and I saw on the television today that there's a man with a mustache running around flashing people, so keep an eye out. Really? Here? Yeah? Well, not in this city, but you never know. Okay, goodbye, Ma. Don't trust anyone with a mustache. <laughs> Hello, my little tortellinis, how are you? I have to go to the bathroom. All right, go ahead. <laughs> Not right here, go to the bathroom. Okay. Hey. So what's with you two? I am in love with your beautiful intellectual granddaughter. Oh, wow. Well. well, I don't know about intellectual because she just tried to shit her pants right here, but that's adorable. What about you? I am in love with an older woman. Oh, I've been there. Back in high school, my first love was a senior and I was a junior, but I was too chicken to say anything, so take Nona's advice and go for it. Okay, I will. Good. You got a picture of her? Ba! Let's see ya, huh? Oh dear god, I retract my statement. Sup bro, how's it going? Uh, not doing so good, my uh, grandma just passed away. I I'm so sorry man, I, I didn't know. You're good bro, you're good. Did she live a long life? Not really. She was only 69. She died yesterday at 4.20pm. <laughs> Hold up, you're laughing? <laughs> no I'm not! Oh, so you think this is funny? <laughs> no I don't, no I don't! We're allergic to the language French. We? Oui? Hey Siri, how do you say seal in French? Fuck. Fuck. This is a cute baby fuck with his ugly motherfucker. Hey, keep eye on my grandma, please. Alright, I got you. Hey babe, can we talk for a second? Uh, Jerry, I'm gonna have to call you back. What is it, babe? There's something I need to tell you. What's going on? I'm pregnant. Hi, pregnant. I'm dad. <laughs> That's the funny thing. You're not. What? Who's the father? Jerry's the father. Is this patient sexually active? <laughs> With your mom. Triple the dosage. But sir, that could kill him. Just fucking do it. You wanna know what I was thinking? We should start referring to your age. As levels. Like, I'm level 20. How fucking cool is that? My son died at level 4. <laughs> Noob. Grandpa, Grandpa! What's that, Sonny? I found a nickel on the ground. Well, that's just wonderful. Remember to put it in your piggy bank. I also found a key buried in your backyard. Oh, uh, well, don't pay no mind to that key. Grandpa doesn't know anything about that. And then I found an abandoned shed that the key unlocks. Oh, uh, that, that sure is strange. And then I went in the shed, and I found a hidden door that leads underground. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be doing that now. And then I found a shotgun, and a bunch of skeletons, and one of them had Grandma's clothes on it. I miss Grandma. Uh, me, me too. Crazy how she just, uh, disappeared like that. <laughs> And then there was one guy that looked all tired and hungry, and he begged me for help. Well, what'd you do? I shot him. Well, that's just wonderful. Grandpa, Grandpa.
What's that, Sonny? I hit a home run at T-ball today. Well, that's just wonderful. Remember to clean the dirt off your cleats. And then the coach told me to tell you he swears he'll get you the money by Tuesday. Oh, well, don't pay no mind to that, coach. He's just joking around. And then after the game, I saw scary men throw coach in a van. They said they worked for you. Oh, that sure is strange. And then I followed the van, and it led to a big warehouse that had a bunch of white powder. It must have smelled really good, because people were putting it in their noses. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be going to strange warehouses now. And then I saw the coach sleeping in a ditch full of ketchup, and then his wife walked up to me and said I look a lot like her illegitimate son. Well, what'd you do? I brought him. Daddy, Daddy! What's that, Sonny? Grandpa, Grandpa! What's that, Sonny? I found a shell on the ground. Well, that's just wonderful. Remember to clean it off in the sink. I also found a green pipe that leads underground. Oh, well, don't pay no mind to that green pipe. Uh, Grandpa doesn't know anything about that. And then I went down the pipe, and it led to a world where all these mean mushrooms started attacking me. Wow, that, that sure is strange. And then I found a castle, and there was a big turtle monster at the end of it. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be speaking to strange turtles now. And then I found a princess, and she told me she saw an old man kidnap her Italian boyfriend. <laughs> Mario! Crazy how he uh, just disappeared like that, huh? <laughs>